Hello everyone, before we get into the video, I just quickly want to say that from now on every video I will be changing the color of my skin and you guys will be the ones who are going to be able to decide which color will be next. So please leave any suggestions of which color you want me to wear in the next video in the comment section. The one with the most likes I'll just pick or just the one I'll prefer the most maybe i don't know we'll see but just yeah go ahead go down to the comment section like the color that you want to see with the most and yeah see you guys later enjoy the video all right guys welcome to the hypixel hc today we're uh going with the stone gear kit you know the regular old strategy which we always tend to use i'm gonna breed these chickens i kind of want to try and get at least six feathers so i want to play it safe all right yeah good thing we bred them we only got six so they've made some changes recently to Hypixie HC, which most of them I kind of like, but I, I don't know, it's, I have kind of mixed feelings about certain topics, like fusion armor for example. Um, I understand their concern why people will become unkillable in deathmatch, but on the other hand, whoever did get full fusion or something, like if, say you were to get full fusion, whoever does put effort into it, like, he put so much effort into the game and all that stuff that honestly, I just feel like he kind of deserves to win anyways. I don't know, I feel like personally they should change Fusion back. Apprentice Bow is also just a bit silly, like, it, it's good that like people can't just go up to Bow's Bow and be super stacked about it. But, you know, now everyone in Deathmatch has a power 4. So we did find a village, we have carrots now, it's pretty good. I'm running away from zero zero, so let's let's stop doing that. Ooh, that's a whole bunch of cane. All right, I'll take that. Definitely would have left some more cane, so that's uh, about perfect. We got over forty here. That's brilliant. Yeah, forty one. Jeez, we're just gonna leave this. Honestly, if someone wants to take it, then they honestly can. It's gonna be nice today. All right, I'm f I'm feeling the nice mood. All right, so we're just gonna walk in a bit closer to zero zero because our cores are pretty terrible at the moment. But uh, yeah, once we get closer, we're good to go down. Alright, there's grass over here, I'm just gonna get dig down straight over here and hopefully find some good stuff on the ground. We got the pickaxe, so I mean, even if we do have to strip mine, it's gonna be a lovely experience. <laughs> honestly, I'm not even joking when I say this, but strip mining with the pickaxe is honestly not that bad. I feel like sometimes the chances of finding diamonds are just much higher because caving can be really difficult for finding diamonds. Well, let's just get all of the coal for this game already and then we can dig down. And yeah, we didn't find a cave but that's fine because of the pickaxe we can just uh, strip mine into oblivion. Alright, come on, giga drilling the gravel. Palika always says to mine your gravel at Y11, so come on, where's the diamonds? Well, no diamonds, but redstone. More redstone, alright. Well, this is just one big laugh at me. Alright, there's a cave over there. We're just gonna block our way towards it. Alright, so we're in a cave now. It's not looking like a bad cave either, it's like Y11. Alright, this is our first iron and we found a spawner. Alright, well we got two bones, so I'm just gonna break that. And we've got two buckets, iron, and iron ore armor. Dude, it's going pretty well. Alright, so uh, we are gonna be able to make a dragon sword, or anderl even for that matter. Oh, that's actually pretty good, I haven't thought of that. Well, either one. It's gonna be really good. And we've already got our 13 levels if we do end up making a ship 3 drag, so lovely. And right, I'm gonna mine this iron because we really don't have a lot of iron yet. We only have 17. Alright, we got both of our lava buckets in case we can make an roll. Uh, that's gonna help us out a lot already. Thing is, I will just try to find diamonds like right now because it would be an advantage having the ship 3 drag. And I might just want to strip mine until I find diamonds. Because that could literally change my game so drastically that I honestly think it's worth strip mining for. And then, you know, we, we might find some gold along the way so that we can actually have some healing. Because we got carrots, but every single game I get carrots, I can make it. I can make the corn. It's literally become a curse by now. Well, this is just being super duper unlucky. More levels. Oh, diamonds. I'll just mine them. Alright, that was a, quite a big vein. can make one piece and a sword with that. It's perfect, so let's do that, and we'll also make boots. Alright, brilliant. That really works out well. And now we can just make all of our iron packs, and then we can make the rest of our armor. Alright, so we got our blaze rod already. We got our blaze powder now. So let's get back up to the cave, and we'll go back to where the lava was, and then we can just make obsidian pretty easily. 
There's only one water source, so we'll make one obsidian, and then we'll also break one obsidian. Alright, now we can just do this, and boom. Dragon sword, can make our anvil, four iron swords, and then make all of our sharp books. Pretty good, pretty nice, all of our sharp books acquired. And here we go, sharpness one dragon sword, sharpness two, and a sharp three. Alright, perfect. I think we can even do this to where we can just literally use all of our prod books, so let's do that. Alright, yeah, sweet. So we've got full prod now. It's pretty damn good. Alright, pretty much set to go up. We'll just make our arrows because we can. Okay, a guy just found me underground, but we do have a sharp 3 drag and he's in the lava now. Alright. Alright, so that's about really good because now what we can do is we can smelt this gold. And then we can dupe apples and we can make our corn finally. Oh wait, we can actually make dice right off the bat. He had yeah, he had stuff on him. Alright, let's just make dice early on in the game. What are we gonna get? Oh, I got Flask of Icar. Last time I used this, I literally screwed it up, so let's not do the same thing this time. Alright, let me just make my corn first. So yep, there we go. Oh, there's another guy coming for me. I'm just gonna use the acre. Yep, that was worth it. He died with the gap. Alright, yeah, that was worth it. We had to do that. I didn't want to take too much damage there, so... How are so many people finding me just underground? I've done nothing wrong, please. Alright. <laughs> At least we did use the Icar the right way this time. Anyways, we're good to go up now after having two kills underground. Oh man, this is so stressful sometimes. Alright, we're good. Thought I was gonna get Obbied again. This is Iron Man. He's on 42. Okay, well he has Absorption Hearts, so that kind of scares me. I really want to go in for melee with him, so I think I need to persuade this fight. Oh shit, Theo boosted. Or Theo Booster, or whatever his name is, he's really sketchy. I'm actually just not gonna go for that. <laughs> he doesn't look legit at all. Yes, target me. Let's go, boys. Let's go. Teaming fest. Alright, well, I'm just gonna continue my way. Hopefully, I won't get teamed on like I did. I'm gonna try and find someone else because this is not fun. Like, some for some reason I keep getting targeted. I'm literally nicked right now. I don't understand. All right, I need to dig. I got him! With gaps. Two gaps. How did I kill that guy? I don't understand. I thought I was dead. Alright. Oh, there's a clean iron right here. Alright, that's Iron Man. Oh! Oh my god, I just drained half of his health. Oh, I got him down to six. What? Oh, dude, he's literally boosting me insane. That's so upsetting. So sad, honestly. There's no fucking way. Oh my god. Alright, this is Ari. Definitely a highlight, like, regardless of what I do. I could keep the blood loss, but I honestly don't think I'll get 10 kills, so I don't really know if it's worth it. I mean, a sharp 4 after 
Some kills, so I may just keep it in my hotboard. Alright, there's a guy right there. Joby Smasher. He's in 39. Well, I'm really undergeared, so if I get this kill, then I have a sharp 4, and then I'll feel a bit safer. It's not that much better than my sharp 3 jack, but it's slightly better, I think. So, dude, he's so aggressive, what? I got him. With gaps. Two gaps. I didn't kill him with the bloodlust, but I don't even care at this point. Alright, there is a potential next victim here. He's in 17, come on, I really need this kill. This guy's in 13 already. Oh no, he has gaps! He's in 19. Dude, I literally don't want him to eat his, all of his gaps. Oh, he might just do it. Okay, so this fight was probably one of the worst bow fights I've ever had. Not because I did bad or anything, just the, the way the guy played wasn't really working for me. Alright, got him. Oh my god, he had a lot of he had a lot of stuff. Come on. G Ed. And two gaps. Alright. He did he had diamond boots as well, so we can make a fusion piece. I know that fusion is less strong now, but I'm gonna need this fusion piece, so I really wanna replace my pants first, so I'm gonna do that. Alright now let's make fusion. Oh my Oh we got leggings, no way. Alright, that's literally the one piece we were missing. Oh, they're fighting. That guy's still in full. What? Oh, he just got him in lava. Alright. That guy's in 11. Yep, I just killed him. My bloodlust is a sharp four right now, so. Yes! I think he was trying to say that he was a subscriber. I'm sorry for killing you if you're watching this video, but if you watched if you've watched the video, you know why I killed you. This was just too dramatic of a game. This guy didn't have anything else on him, it seems like. Oh my, this was one hectic game, but uh I've come back to quite nicely. Alright, so I mean we got a sharp 4, so that's better than my sharp 3 jag. And one more kill and we have a sharp 5 bloodlust, so we're definitely gonna go for that. Alright, we got it. And he had 2 ender pearls on him. Oh, 5 caps! There's no way we're losing this game now. What the hell? Sharp 5 drag. Pretty nice. Totally balanced. How did we get back from this game? We were on like two and a half hordes. This is just insane. I don't understand this. Alright, so this guy is Sunniki. He's on five. No wonder he's running. I can probably kill him before deathmatch. It's still like a minute. We really need to catch up to this guy. I really want this guy's head. He's not gonna have a chance anyway in deathmatch. Please don't run. No! I didn't get the kill. Alright, I got his head though. And I got a third G head with that. Alright. That worked out quite well after all. And I'll just pearl over the middle. Oh, that was such a bad pearl. Got the gaps regardless. There's a guy over here. I don't know who it is, but they seem to be going into a fight. But this guy... Oh, he's full diamond and he's taking so much damage, holy. Alright, let's just go into this man. Yep, he's taking so much damage as a full diamond, that's actually impossible. Well, no, he's 3 forwards, sorry. I think he's out of heals, yup. Let's make fusion. This guy's definitely our only threat this game.
I'm like barely taking damage because of the fusion. Because in 12, I need to go for him. Alright, got him. Now I need to go in for the other fight. I don't want them to kill each other. He's not going to be able to get away this time. No, he is. This guy plays so annoying. I'm not out of healing yet though, so that's good. We have a power 4. So I feel like I should be ghost farming a bit. Yep, I got him. I don't think this guy can kill me, but he can try. Oh, he's <laughs> he's already dead. Ah, <laughs> uh, GG, dude. GG. 14 kill game. I honestly don't know how I win the how, how I won this. I honestly don't.